ADAPT is a national grassroots disability rights organization, and what it means to me is it's a vehicle for me to make meaningful social change in the world for people with disabilities. I need young people because ADAPT Texas has been around since 1985. Some of our older members have passed away, or or they can't do um, a lot of the physical actions that we used to be able to do. Uh, and also the technology has changed significantly since 1985. What do you want? Access! Access. Do you want a really nice picture that, um, actually they're marching from the White House. It was for a rally. Like the Declaration of ADA will lead the way with the emancipation. And right after the rally um, is when they did the great crawl up. And that's when the young girl here, Jennifer Keelan, crawled up on the steps with 75 other people. But it was a, it was a great march. And the next day, at the, in the rotunda, you had 107 people be arrested. It closed down the, the whole capital for six to eight hours. It takes a long time um, if, you're, if you're in a chair and stuff to actually be put in a paddy wagon. On the national level, working on the Disability Integration Act, we are working on the Empower Care Act, and we are working on the Stop the Shock campaign and also affordable, accessible, integrated housing. The Disability Integration Act will do on the federal level. It's sort of a companion to the Americans with Disabilities Act, which was passed in 1990. It will make it easier for someone to stay in the community and live in the community if they need. They will be less likely to ever go into a nursing home in their lifetime. We don't just use you know, one method to make change. We use media and which is one prong. We use legislative or administrative, which is another prong. We use nonviolent direct action, which is another prong. We use political and we use um, system administrative. So that is the five prong approach to social change that ADAPT uses. Let me now explain the Adaptive Texas famous button wall. Everybody likes this wall. All these buttons represent um, various campaigns we've done over the years. Our homes, not nursing homes. That represents us wanting to stay in the community and live in the community like everybody else. No pity also represents that people with disabilities are not to be pitied. We're like everybody else. This one actually is up Wade Blank. The founder of ADAPT in Denver, Colorado, who passed away several years ago, but who, without him and without the Gang of 19 in Colorado, ADAPT Texas would not exist, would not be part of National ADAPT. And let me now tell you about this flag. It, it may look like a regular American flag, but it's not. It's what we call the ADAPT wheelchair flag. And the reason we you know, fashion the stars in the shape of a person in a chair is because too long people with disabilities have been devalued by our own country. And so we take this flag very seriously. We actually take it on national actions, join us here in Texas, become part of National ADAPT, and continue to do this work, start to do this work, just do the work and make meaningful social change that will affect everybody's life, including your own.